Hello, I'm Luke Sison. I'm standing here in the empty Fitzwilliam Museum where I'm the director. The Fitz is such an important part of what Cambridge University offers to the world. And of course, we've been terribly sad that we haven't been able to open to the public since March the 17th, when we closed thanks to the pandemic, along with every other museum in the, in the country. It's been a, it's been a, a strange period, um, and visiting here has felt a little melancholy. Um, pictures need people, so do works of art. There's a kind of interaction that we've been, been missing here. Um, but now we're getting ready for reopening and a, and a new energy has entered the building as we think about the return of, our, of the Friends of the Fitzwilliam, of the Mali Group, of the members of the university and in fact of every visitor um, to, to the museum uh, in, in early August. When that happens we'll be able to um, re-experience um, all these wonderful works of art that we have the privilege of looking after. And, um, and some exhibitions will still be um, underway for, for people to enjoy. Of course, in the meantime, we haven't been wasting our time and we've been very conscious indeed that people haven't been able to experience the works of art, the great pieces of archaeology and all the other things that we have here um, in the flesh. So we've been thinking very hard indeed about what our online offer looks like and developed a project that we've called Fitz Virtual thinking about all the things, all ways in which our different audiences can interact with the collections that we have. So a project like, for example, Look, Think, Do, that our learning team has pioneered, is something that you might want to um, visit on our, on our website. And of course, too, we've been thinking about what the financial challenges of this period are, to think about imaginative ways of, of um, generating income during this period. So, for example, we've issued uh, a series of greetings cards based on some of our most famous old master paintings with the addition of face masks to, to the, the, the people in them. And that's really get, garnered us international uh, attention at a very good moment in a way for, for us while the museum was closed. And it's that kind of creativity, I think, that will see us beyond the, the, the stage of the pandemic into the future. The Fitzwilliam Museum has an extraordinary history, a, a great tradition, but it's also a place of, of huge potential. There's so much more we can do with your support and with your help. And that's really why I'm talking to you today. When we, visit, when we welcome you back to the Fitzwilliam in August, we want to see this as the beginning of a, of a new chapter. And we really want all of you involved. Thank you very much.